Hi there, my name is Axiom, and in this video, I'm going to cover how I set up the module GM Screen. So with the module installed, we gain a new tab at the bottom of the screen. When we click on this, we get a virtual GM screen. This can be set up with many different tabs as required. You can also add more by right hand clicking on the GM screen, then hitting add and naming your new tab. Each tab will give you a grid that you can configure and add in items like journal entries, actors, rollable tables, and this can be data that's stored within the world or can be from a companion pack. For mine, I set up a main page where I keep things that I need reminding of more often. For example, remembering concentration checks, random names, lists of poisons, and things like improvising damage. As you can see, each of these little columns, you can actually scroll down and read as you need. I keep a page for conditions as a reminder, then a page of all my PCs, and I sometimes will have another tab with their background or history, a page for NPCs, and this is a good example of you can configure the grid to be of different sizes. So if I go and click on the cog item here, you can tell it how many rows and columns to span. So this one has been made larger because this has a lot of my data on my NPCs. You can also have the stat plots of some of the NPCs as needed. Then lastly, at the moment, I keep a page for potions of healing just to remind myself what needs to be rolled. So these are all the items I currently keep on my GM screen. But if there's any suggestions, please let me know. Thank you for listening and please like and subscribe for more content.